Salicylates are really important. They are as likely to be affecting you as artificial colours and preservatives. Now, most people are happy to take out the colours and preservatives. For instance, if you have a child with behaviour problems, then 70% of those react to salicylates. But people fudge it. One woman thought she could get away with having a cup of tea a day. Tea is high in salicylates and she couldn't get away with it. And if your dietician says you can have an apple a day, well, maybe some people can, but most apples are high in salicylates. Delicious apples are moderate in salicylates and that is far too much for a lot of people. If you have got to this stage, you're here because the diet isn't working and it means you need to cut down to the low column for salicylates. If you'd like more information about salicylates, you can email me for our salicylate mistakes information sheet. Now the important thing to realise with salicylates is that you're not going to see a reaction if you're having a cup of tea a day or an apple a day or whatever. What will happen is that your symptoms will seem to come and go with no obvious cause or they might build up gradually. It's only when you reduce your salicylate intake enough that you'll get the results from the diet that you want.